okay, I'm going to try to record this at late at night, and you can tell it's 4.03 in the morning, so um, I might be tired or wasted. So um, let's uh, do this how-to video on muting your Skype call, or muting your call from the Skype, so when you're streaming, so you don't want to hear people's drama or hearing background noises during the cutscene of a game, for example, or... Or if it's private, you can mute your microphone using the hotkey. So it might be different. So I'm using a voice meter banana to set this up in the first place to have my recording set up for this. Um, so I set my voice meter banana as, as a different tutorial. So I'm going to basically tell you how to set this up. So first you go into your Skype options or your tool and you go to the option. And you go into your audio settings and you select you select your speaker or your main speaker that you use for Skype for calling. And you set your uh, speaker, a separate speaker like your headset, not your game audio, your default audio device as your that pick up the sound from your game. This might be different. So if I was showing you an example, if you have a USB headset that's for the Skype call or something different, you set it up to your aux input. This is my separate audio coming from Skype as a st separate channel. This is my Skype channel. It'll only pick up this channel, and for bio, it'll only pick up the game audio. So sometimes I didn't set that up back in the past. So you save that as if you have your have your headset audio for Skype as another channel, and if you have your game audio, set it as your default device. So save, and then. Then you go into your setting page for your uh, sync to set it up. So you go to the audio tab, then you select your default audio device. I set mine to voice meter input or your desktop speakers. Um, use your desktop speakers or your output speakers or something as your voice meter input. Or if you have a just main your, your main desktop audio device that probably connected to your TV or anything and have your Skype call as a different one if you have your Skype audio device and you select your headset or your thing that you use for Skype to call on and you set it up for that and in your main audio device you can set up multiple uh, devices if you want I don't do that just use one mainly for recording so now you're all set up you should set up the hotkey so your setup may be different than mine, so I don't know what I could tell you. I'm just trying to explain as well as I can. So I set my hotkey to start recording with alt slash. Then I have my desktop audio as alt back. Sometimes if you hit that key just by itself, or if you have a hotkey set up on your keyboard, you set it up with the hotkey. So this will mute the, this, so select your audio that's for your Skype. For desktop audio too, you don't have to put anything for desktop audio. If you want to leave the game chat mute or unmute, just you can keep the game audio just blank. So for your Skype, just select Alt and then slash or your hotkey. Then you slash for your microphone if you want to mute your mic. If it's for privacy reasons, if you want to like not talk about drama back to that guy again, because one of my friends tried to record was doing a stream and I heard drama and I felt like leaving the stream because of it so you set up your alt and slash so you set it up I'm going to prove to it it works so check the bottom screen right here I'm going to try to go into my options page so so also it does work with Skype so believe me it will work um, go to your audio setting if I press this play button and press the microphone button You'll see that there's two red marks right there. Let me play the button right now. Then I'll also mute the audio, but you can still hear from the Skype call. And also that's with the as well with the microphone. If you want to mute your mic as well, you can still talk to people with with Skype if it's muted on the OBS software. So I said you can't hear me now because I muted the microphone if you want to do it for private reason but you can still keep your game audio on okay you might have to configure it your own settings if you want 
Sometimes if you don't want to hear loud peep, if you lower the decibels, I have my desktop audio lower because it's for commentary purposes only. So if you like this tutorial, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. I am trying to keep it quiet. So thanks for watching the video and bye.